We want to take it to Ottawa now. Finance Minister Bill Morneau is making an announcement about lowering taxes. Let's listen. So we, we know that the very first thing that we want to move forward in is a reduction in taxes for middle class Canadians. It's why today we are moving forward with that as the first order of business. The way we're going to do that is by taking the basic personal exemption, the amount that people can deduct so that they don't actually have to pay taxes until they hit that amount. We're going to raise that amount. We're going to raise that amount to $15,000 between here and 2023. We know that that will have an important impact. Mona is going to talk. Uh, Minister Fortier is going to talk a little bit about the uh, details of how that impacts families and, uh, and individuals. But I think very importantly, what it means is that 20 million Canadians will see a tax reduction, a reduction that will increase over the period from here to 2023. It also means that 1.1 million more Canadians will pay no federal tax at all. So we know this is going to have a very, impact, very important impact on, on those 20 million Canadians. But at the same time, we're doing it in a way that's means-tested, so that it doesn't actually impact the top 1%. So it will be means-tested a way so that the impact goes to those 20 million Canadians that we're intending to do it for. So we're very pleased to talk about this, and more detail from uh, Minister Fortier. Merci, Ministre Morneau. Mr. Morneau. Bon matin, tout le monde. Good morning, everyone. Comme l'a mentionné, le As mentioned, Morneau, Minister Morneau, our government continues to deploy the efforts in order to improve the quality of life of the middle class and of every person working hard to be part of it. That's why our first point of order in 2015 was to go forth with the lowering of promised income tax cuts for the middle class. And the first point, once again, is to do the same thing. In 2015, we've asked Canadians that are richer among us, to represent 1% of the population, to pay a little bit more in order for us to be able, able to reduce income taxes for the middle class. This lowering was help more than 9 million Canadians because it gave back hundreds of dollars in the pockets of middle-class people. And it, and it, it let the amount of, at $15,000 would represent the hundreds of dollars or more in their pockets. And when this change will be completely put in force in 2023, one person would save over $300 in income tax. And for families, including single parent families, it would translate into $600 of savings per year. It will enable people to keep a larger part of what they earn and makes cost of living more affordable for the middle class and for all those working hard to be part of it. When this change is fully rolled out in 2023, a single person would save close to $300 a year in taxes. And for families, including those led by a single parent, the savings would be close to $600 a year. It's a change that would let, help, help, let people keep more of what they earn and help make life more affordable for the middle class and those working hard to join it. Mention Minister Morneau, there are, there's still much work to do to make sure that Canada is a country where everyone has a chance and the opportunity to succeed where everyone can prosper. Today's announcement is part of this work. It's with pleasure that we will answer your questions now. 